so here we are today, flying lights. And there's old Wesley up there, wiring them up. So initially, I thought we can get away with running a single chain to dual sides, as you can see over there, like that. But they tend to rotate. So with the fans, which I kind of was concerned about, but I was like, eh, we'll give it a go. So I had to make a quick John over to Home Depot, get some more hooks. Not a big deal. So we'll figure we'll try for today. We'll try and get that done. But Wesley went ahead, Wesley and Magley, last night, went and taped up this whole bay. So that's why we're flying lights in it. And they did a pretty good job. It looks nice. So Wesley did an experiment with some acetone and a towel and wiped off the lettering. Wondering what you guys think if we should wipe off the lettering or just leave it. It does look a lot cleaner. If you go over to this last bay, there's no lettering on that because that's a different brand, I guess, altogether. So it leaves it uh, a little cleaner looking. And then here's the piece that uh, Wes wiped off. So it comes off fairly easy. It leaves a bit of residue though. But let us know what you think. If we should remove it or leave it because we'll be up taping It'll just take a little bit of extra time <laughs> My lack of chin <laughs> What's going on here? I was just trying to learn how to do something I got the tiny little hands so yeah, well, I do the wiring We got one light lit Let's get more. So we just need to get this one and these, those two. We need to, you can see we changed it to a dual so they're not crooked like that from the fans and just however the chain naturally flows. So we're double on it, double chains so it won't double twist. Double. Yep, fun, fun. We're going to have four in this, this lane here, we'll have four in this one, and then the M one will have three, and one that's already hanging there, and then the center one we're going to do eight footers that we already have over in the other shop instead of having to buy more because we're going to have our lift right where that fork lift is, so and that should be adequate, it will light this place up. With all the white walls and the silver ceiling. Ceiling. <laughs> and there's Joe. He's got a mop. Mop boy. And there were two. They were lit. Only two more to go. We got three. Three lights up, flying, wired up. I might go a little higher with it because it seems like we're getting a lot more of the back half here. And when we run another set over here, I don't want to have a dead, slight shadows here. So we might actually raise them up another two, three feet. These are actually designed to go higher. They work better the higher they are, but I didn't really want to light up that whole wall, per se. We still got to do this light yet. We ran out of time for today, so we'll have to hit that tomorrow. So, And I'll probably piece this all together in one vlog, since I didn't get a lot of footage today, because it's hard to work and film at the same time. That's why we need Dan, old Danny boy. But we got three lit so far. We'll have a fourth one, and then we'll work on this. But we gotta tape it first, because it's really hard to maneuver around lights on chains, and then these three bars. Um, it's really hard to maneuver that big lift in between it and access everything, so. Well, that's where we're at for now, so. 